I've been concerned about this in looking at issues like community land trusts that preserve affordability right. because we're running out of right. uh, of units. We're, we're, we're retiring units at a fairly rapid rate at this right. time. Have you given us a report about the number? I feel we've had some reporting, but I think it would be helpful to us to get an idea of what inventory we're losing. Uh, so, you know, it's, so in other words, we're not even keeping even is my okay. impression. We'd be happy to glean the number of reports that have that data. Uh, the University of Miami's MAP program has that information online. Uh, the, Excuse me uh, for interrupting, yes. uh, Madam Chair. The University of Miami has done this comprehensive report on the availability of those units and those mm -hmm. that are expiring. Would it make sense to have them come and make a presentation to this committee? It's Robin Backen, who's the uh, vice right. provost. She's on sabbatical right now, but certainly there's still the office and there are people. There's an acting uh, uh, director there, and their uh -huh. technical lead on that is Mr. Uh, Jorge De La Plaz, De La Plaz. very bright guy. And uh, I think it might be useful for them to uh, come by and, and do a presentation. They're also having a, um, I think it's next week, a, um, a meeting where they will talk about the tool, the mapping tool that they have, which includes a lot of this data uh, that can be brought up at any time, uh, inclusive of um, this issue of um, uh, private privately owned property, which is under a Section 8 uh, program. This is, this is all Section 8. This other Section 8 program where the leases, uh, where, where the contracts are expiring. like that before yes. your office. Uh, but in any event, um, I think that would be useful. So uh, I pass that to you, Madam Chair, for oh, your consideration. You, yeah, you can put that on. I would okay. love for you to put it on the agenda. Yeah. Okay. Good. Consider it done. Very good.